Hey guys, welcome to another video by Chmai, Search Chmai. And, uh, so this is another video for, for uh, RC Racer Beast. And, uh, so we figured out a pretty good trade that we're going to do. Um, I'm trading him my T-Max 3.3 with all the upgrades and all the extra parts that are in my toolbox with my helicopter. And he's giving me his low C8 uh, 1.0 buggy with a Pico engine and a mini E-Revo brushless that's uh, all stock. So, uh... That's uh, it's a pretty good deal. Um, he's including some extras, and I'm including some extras, and they both have upgrades on them. So, yeah, uh, why don't we get started here? And uh, sorry about the mess, you guys, on my table. Um, I've been working on my Revo a lot. Uh, you can see there, the transmission's out of it again. And uh, there it is. So, uh, so let me move this stuff out of the way so I don't uh, lose any parts to this. Because that would not be funny. So don't laugh. So, anyway, so we're going to start here for the vid with RC Racer Beast. Um, and RC Racer Beast, you can include it if you want, but I already have one of these. Um, it's, mine's a hob, uh, mine's a H-O-B-A-O, -O, I assume that's ho, hob, I don't even know. So, I got one that's a 17, 17, 7, 10, and 8, but if you want to include another one, because... My glow plug end there is stripped out, so it'd be great if I can get another one. But yeah, you don't have to. So uh, we're making videos of what all comes with our stuff. So uh, yeah, here we go. Um, so we'll start off with the truck here. Um, so here's the truck itself. Um, I'm just going to go over the upgrades quick. 3.3 uh, engine, barely used. 3.3 uh, silver clutch upgraded. Two speed and four only conversion. Um, receiver rechargeable tracks, hump pack battery, upgraded servos. No radio or receiver included, but I will include the servos and stuff. Motor saver air filter. Um, pretty, pretty nice. I've used this a lot, so uh, I just got a new neck for it not too long ago. Traxxas aluminum big bore shocks with all new springs, and they were just rebuilt with the Traxxas rebuild shock kits. Um, RPM arms all the way around. RPM um, bumper or something, I gotta think of it. So, uh, yeah, that's about it. Um, T6 right anodized aluminum tie rods in the front. Traxxas resonator pipe. And uh, that's about it for the upgrades. And uh, I will include, um, not that, I will include a set of Talon tires. One of them is blowing, I'm just letting you know that. And, um, these Bowtie 40 series with 14 millimeter hex rims. Um, one of these is kind of stripped out, but if you would work it enough, you could make it work really nice. Um, it was, it's barely stripped out and it works good. So, but I'm not including these tires. These are my Bowtie 30 series for my Revo, so those are not included. So you get the two sets of tires there. Um, Super Brain 809 charger is coming with you. So that'll be in the box too. Um, a bag of goodie bags. We went over these in the video for you. So you get that with it. Um, the extra gas tank. So in case you got that broke, you can fix that. Put the body on the Revo here quick. Uh, like I said, no radio included, but you're giving me a radio. Um, so... And then we'll go down here quick. All the extra parts that are in here, I really don't want to tear these all out right now because then I just have to put them all back in before I package it up here because i got to work on my Revo a little bit tonight. So all the parts in here, you will, you know what all comes with that. Um, and I think that was it. Yeah, so you got all the extra parts in here. You have the truck itself. Oh, the Roto Starter. This is a Revo air filter. Sorry about that. You get the Roto Starter with the battery in there. Um, the extra gas tank, like I said, the parts, the baggy parts, uh, air filter. Um, I will include this little cap that I use to plug the air filter, or it just goes right over the carburetor right there. Yeah, it just keeps the dust out of it and stuff. So, like, when I'm working, and, uh, yeah. So, here's the under chassis. Pretty good looking. Um, it actually even stands up on its own. Like I said, the... Rear skid plates broke off like right where it bends, like right here. Like right there where it bends, it's a snapped off, so not a big deal. 
Like I said, all our PMA arms all the way around. Uh, chassis brace was just replaced. The transmission is basically new. The disc brake is pretty new. With the dynamite 4mm chassis is there too. So, uh, and uh, now we'll go to the helicopter here. So just let me move all this stuff over here. So, uh, helicopter, um, I guess I will open up this box so you know that you do know what's uh, in here and everything. And, uh, so hang on, just let me open this up here quick. And, uh, comes with this nice little carrying handle here for the box. So. So, there we are. Um, so, in this little baggie here. So, let me open up this baggie quick here. Alright, so uh, in this baggie, you have a little baggie of bearings for the helicopter, just in case you ever need them. Um, here you have a flight simulator thing that plugs right into the back of the remote. Um, extra tail rotor and four extra main blades, there are two in each bag. So, four extra main rotor blades. Let me uh, open this up here. Uh, we'll get to the helicopter in a minute there. Um, LiPo charger for the LiPo. It's a, just a standard DC plug-in charger. You just plug it into the wall. And uh, the 7.4 volt 1000 mAh LiPo battery here. Pretty good condition, a little bit of wire shown over here. Not too much, but big deal, so. Uh, right here we have the 2.4 gigahertz radio system. You got your throttle, yaw, forward, backwards, left and right. You got your four trims. I will include the batteries. It does have a battery indicator on there. And there's the back of it. You can also plug in a rechargeable battery in here. And then you can just plug in your 12 volt 50 mAh charger right there so like I said before 2.4 gigahertz which is nice don't have to worry about interference at all and uh, now the helicopter the helicopter is uh, pretty nice just hang on here a second though I'm gonna put this stuff back in here so I don't have to do it later And uh, so, yeah, here, now they're on to the helicopter. Uh, helicopter is brand new blades on the top here. Just put those on. Brand new tail rotor blade. You can see that all three blades are on there. So, uh, carbon fiber stabilizers and landing. Um, you have their stabilizer bars here on the bottom. Right there, right where my thumb's rubbing on. Um, aluminum bell structure. For where it spins at, you have metal stabilizer bars. Um, let me take the canopy off here. So canopy's pretty beat up here. Got a crack in the windshield there. Small little crack or chip there. Um, over here on this side, it's cracked right there. And it's cracked there. Not too big of a deal. You can buy them for like they're a couple bucks. And. Uh, the tail rotor is shaft driven by a small motor with a heat sink. Uh, motor in this is brand new, only flowing like half a battery on it. Um, the only thing that you will need for this, it's got the little mini servos in it too. The only thing that you will need for this is a new receiver. The receiver, I think, bugged out on me, so that's not too big of a deal. They're like 20 bucks. Um, go on the website, and yes, is this spelled how it sounds? It's Wow Hobbies, and no spaces. Wow Hobbies and type in Walk Era CB180D helicopter and it'll come up with this. They're like 15, 20 bucks, real cheap. And uh, but they're nice parts. So they're super nice quality parts. Just let me put this back on here. Um, it flies real nice too. And uh, like I said, I've only flown it a few times, so it's basically new. Um, like I said, I did replace the motor in it and all the blades and everything because you will break the blades. I know that for a fact, so uh, that's why I'm including all the extras with it. 
Um, one more little teeny tiny thing here, not too big of a deal. It's cracked right there. And, and again, not, not big of a deal. So, yeah, and that's the helicopter. And, uh, so, uh, comes with this little snap on box here. So, hey, you get the helicopter, the T Max, and all the X parts and everything. So, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, peace out, you guys. Take it easy, and thank you, RC Racer Beast, for this awesome trade. You're a pretty great guy, and uh, just want to say thanks again for this trade. I really appreciate it. So, uh, take it easy, guys, and see you later. Bye.